Okay, guys. So we this was a last minute segment, but I had to talk about it. It's only a one minute clip, and then we're gonna have like a conversation about it. But uh, we, I was on TikTok, and my wife was next to me, and I scrolled up to this, and we it was it's Booger and his girlfriend, and. <laughs> For some reason, when I call him Booger, she she can't stop. She it gets, gets me so, every time because it's just so dumb. Like it's not it's even like, funny. and it's you just so I mean? like it's so small, <laughs> and you just move right past it. It gets me every single time. I love it. So it's about him and his girlfriend. He's fifty, and now he's dating a nineteen-year-old girl. You know, I guess God bless him. And she just you winced. But first, could we confirm? Can you show me like an old boogie thing? What does that mean? Like, he used to be really popular, right? Yeah, yo, you want, like, his most popular video? Let me see, because I'm trying to see if he's the guy that I remember or not. Like, he did, like, a character named Francis. Why is your character named Like, you want, me to f you want me to find, like... Like, is he the guy who, like, he, like, would sit at a computer chair and get really angry and, like, flip the desk or yeah, something? Yeah, yeah, that's exactly him. I feel like my ex used to watch him and I would see his videos on Facebook. Oh, this is the exact video you're referring to. This is the... Oh, it went away. Wait, this is the exact video that you're referring to right here. Well, I, I still don't understand why I mean, you're no, not... No, I don't think I've ever I, seen this before, but... Oh. Okay. What am I going to do? Plot with a fucking dice? I... I you might. I mean, well, no, it's just bullshit. You got a lot of I what I'm trying to say is fine, fine. I don't even have cards in my hand. And I talk like a fucking land. This shit is 14 of 17. Fuck! So are you done? Yeah, go. Just go. I mean, go ahead and attack me. Okay, well, I think we could yeah, move on. You can, Especially, I've never seen this before. This is exactly what you've seen. This is exact. This is it. That's what you were talking about. No, I literally have never seen this. But All right, this is what your this is what your ex boyfriend used to watch. Okay, and that had nine million views or eight million views on it. Okay, and that's like his most popular stuff. That's where he comes from. People play like the nerd character. Did he have like a camera from a side angle? I'm just really I, trying to I remember never, if I never this watched, is the guy I never, or not. I watched him sometimes. Like occasionally, I come across something, but I was never like super uh, into it. Um. I don't know. He's a lol cow. Maybe he's another lol. This is this TikTok is called lol cow highlights, which I is really, very funny. Oh, man, is it this guy? I really need to make this fucking money. I honestly uh, don't know. Oh, man, no. I mean, I'm close. I'm this close. I'm this close. Look at these guys. Look at them all. Look at this. Look at this guy. This guy. I mean, I'm so close. I I'm I so just, close. I don't think that you are. I'm so close to being a lol cow. I don't think that you Why are. Why don't you think I'm a lol cow? Because I just don't think that you there's are. An, okay? There's a, there are other large uh, men that are cl very close to Lowell Cowdom. I don't know, man. I would just get a real job at that point. I couldn't. I couldn't stand the embarrassment, and the shame. Anyway, let's get back on topic. Boogie and his new girlfriend. We saw this on TikTok, and you kind of made a face. And so, like, let's watch this. It's a minute clip, and then we're gonna talk about it. Oh, man, nobody's gonna like this answer. Nobody's gonna like this answer. But it's like a, it's an energy thing. It's a compatibility thing. An itch like, thing. yeah, I'm in a later stage of life. She's in an earlier stage of life. Yeah. I want to help her with like a lot of the things that she needs to learn in life, like uh, I don't know, just life lessons and stuff that I figured out either the hard way or. The what do you want? <laughs> You're just like, are you, are you getting creeped out? No. Okay. The easy way, right? like things like I'm right or wrong, but. I don't know, I've never, I hold her hand, I feel like it's home. Like, it just feels like home. And you said the same thing to me, right? We just... You think that she said the same thing, or she was like, yeah, sure. I, I don't know, just, we need to finish <laughs> okay, this video. Okay, listen, I have to talk, I have to I know, I'm, I just I'm, need to I'm take everything in. content, you know? I know you need to take it in, and I need to just talk constantly. Soulmates, you said soulmates yeah. once. And I don't, I can't argue with that. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, yeah, I got I to gotta tell the story from today when I was talking to your grandmother. So your grandma, we were on, we were driving home from Sam's Club and her grandmother's like, you know, I think that when somebody passes, well, what I actually said was I wish my father wasn't alive, right? And because, you know, he's a, he's, a, he's a sperm donor, he's a scumbag asshole. 
whatever. And she's like, don't say stuff like that. Don't put that in the universe. I'm like, that's fair. And she's like, I think when people die, their souls go into a baby, into a newborn. And I said, oh, does that mean that if I died right now, uh, and I went into somebody, and I went inside of some woman's, you know, uh, cooter, and I came out a baby. Would it be okay for my wife to marry a child? And she goes, "I don't know, maybe." She said, "I guess if she's in love with the baby." <laughs> I was like, "That's just wild. Why would you say that?" Hmm. Oh, that just reminded me of that story. On paper, it doesn't make any sense. On paper, it's weird and creepy, and I get it. And I- I've spoken out against this exact kind of thing when other content creators did it. Um, but. He's talking about like him star dating a young person too. I mean, it's undeniable. There's an well, energy. An adult, just to be clear. Just, like, you know, just want to be clear. I don't want anybody to misinterpret that, but like a you know, like a twenty year old at forty kind of a thing. There, and I can't not give it a shot. You know, yeah. the f- no, man, nobody's gonna like this. So here, here, here's my thing. First of all, listen. It's not illegal. I don't really care. She's old enough to make her own decisions, and maybe she'll, she'll grow a couple of years later. She'll be like, oh, that was cringy. She'll look back on it with some cringe. They're, I don't care about that. But I found it weird that you're, like, in, you're in love with a 19-year-old. That's the weird part to me. Like, I get, I, I get it. Like, you're in a midlife crisis, and you're like, oh, I want to kind of like, I want to do a little bit of a fling with a younger girl. Like, okay, whatever. I get it. But you're like, I, when I held her hand, I prematurely ejaculated. Oh, I love this girl. To me, it's a little cringe. Um, I guess my thoughts are, I don't really know about this guy, but from what I've heard through you, yeah. is that like and he's I am the best struggling, yeah. like professionally, right? Sure. Yeah. Like he did, he's lost a considerable amount of credibility. He's a very lazy person um, that doesn't really like do content. Like he complains that he doesn't have money, at least historically. And then he just like won't do content. Mm-hmm. He's like, if you guys d- give me like five hundred dollars of memberships a month, I'll start doing the content in my private stuff. And I'm like, just start doing it now and have a product to sell. You know, he's a little bit of a he. Uh, he's a little bit of a you know he he's like a little bit. He's struggling and failing a little bit. He's a. I don't even think that this is somebody that would be, is necessarily even in the failing thing. That's what's so annoying is that like if he makes regular content, he will be successful financially and otherwise. It's just that like he plays a victim complex because like. You know, his videos were like a two minute long, just like pretending to be a, a, a crazy character. And then like he wants to be able to put that same level of like output work wise to maybe, you know, to make money. Um, But but he's emotionally so struggling for with sure. That I just feel like my first thought is the reason why this like is a video is like for success reasons. What do you mean? Like the reason that he posted this? Yeah. Explain wife. Because. This is the hot topic and a, uh, not a cliche. What is the word? A taboo? I guess a little right bit of a taboo. Now. Yeah, sure. So I would, Im- I don't know, like why, who is he talking to? Who is doing this video? Oh, so I don't know what video it's part of, but like a lot of his content from what I've seen now is really just him talking about his girlfriend. Well, yeah, so. Are you saying he's playing into constantly talking about her because it what? makes him money? Yeah, it looks like it's this one. AMA for me and my girlfriend. Uh, look at this. Forcing the kid behind the camera to go to the beach with his girlfriend's there. Uh, GameStop can't compete. His girlfriend's in there. Uh, girlfriend doesn't happen to be in this thumbnail, so that's crazy. Girlfriend, girlfriend, girlfriend. Um, she's the one holding the camera. So, like, she's in pretty much every one of the new videos. Um, yeah. So, but look, even here, look how frequent, infrequently posts. Like every three or four days, like one ten-minute video. I mean, like why? Like you, you could do so much more output. It's just like lazy to me. I don't know. It's we we're hard. just having a conversation outside of this about how like the weirdest guys always have a girlfriend and. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't really have much to say. I think. Okay, you just had um, you just had like a visceral reaction when we were looking at it on. Um, yeah. You're just like ugh. Because like, oh my fucking god! Like for fucking what, bitch? Like, well, you know. But you know what? Maybe he's fucking handing out like. <laughs> prime, prime, but, prime pork. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think so. Maybe he has like a fucking finger blaster three thousand. Maybe, you don't or know. maybe he's just an older guy with money, and, and uh, he wants to take care of this girl. And she's like, "Sure, I'll try something new." Does he have money? I thought he didn't have any. And it's like I think he has like he has enough to be able to take care of some girl if they live in like a rural area. You know what I mean? So he's he's definitely paying for everything. That's more than like they, a lot of the, some of their contents. Like they're going to this comic con and this con and this con, and they're going to like the conventions. 
Uh, so she's probably just having fun, and he's probably like, oh my god, I'm in love again. And, you know, I think it, it's, uh, you know, I get it. He's an older guy. He's had a lot of struggles in his life, as much as he may be unlikable. And so, like, for him, I think part of this is, like, I still got it. You know what I mean? It's like, I still got Because I, I understand that feeling. Like, I still got it. What, I still got it to get other women? Yeah, it's. Yeah, I don't even totally, want. I don't want another. No, woman. you don't. But that's like tell the want, Costco story today. I don't want another or woman. Wherever but I, we were, Sam's on. Club. Let me explain. I don't want another woman, but I want to be able to get another woman. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Because it's like I'm a man. I'm like, oh, I want to be able to, you know. So there was like a there was a a a, 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 a girl looking at me and smiling at me, and it's, you know she was a thicker black woman. Looking at me, kept smiling at me every time I looked over. I was, I, I was just looking for a place to put our cart because it was the food section, you know, like. And my Grammy sat in the worst fucking place possible, oh, like right in front of the soda machine. So like, I'm just looking for and a place. We had where we two sit. carts because she went shopping and we went shopping. And we fold them up, so I'm looking for a place to put the carts. And she's like, every time I look at her, she's like looking at me. She's smiling at me. And I'm like, ooh, I still got it. I feel pretty good. Oh, yeah, but don't leave out the important part. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I well, I you know, I know what my wife is, and you know, so I had to make sure that this girl knew that I was, um, that I was married. So I kissed my wife. Yeah, but then he made the mistake of he didn't tell me till, Why I think I till after you? we dropped Grammy off. What were you gonna do? Yell at her? No, I would have turned around and looked at her. Okay, well, you don't need to do that. Okay, you don't need to do that. Um. But so back to Boogerman. Um, <laughs> okay. I, you know what? Good, good for him for a little bit. Yeah, and it's for a her, crisis. She'll talk about this. It's an experience for her to yeah. be able to get older. Like, oh my god, like, Adina, oh my me. god, I yeah. can't believe what I did when I was nineteen. Nineteen is that's a little, mm, a little cringe for me. What do you mean? What's cringe? But um, like nineteen, 19 is or? just too close to seventeen. Oh, dating you know, wise, yeah. I, I, I don't. I guess I think it's fine. Nineteen, eighteen, like I don't. Care. It's completely legal. That's what I'm saying. I just think that socially, like, I, I don't know. I mean, I'm being judgmental right now. She has tattoos. That do you see that large tattoo on her arm? Sure, yeah, like a. So to print. me, that says that she might be interested in things like above her. Her I got out of You know what I'm saying? <laughs> sure. I don't know. I feel like if it was, if, it, you know, it, it's always going to be close to, like, you know, what, there's a cutoff. It's like, okay, the aging sense 18. It's like, ah, oh, but that's so close to not being in the aging sense. Like, yeah, that's why there's a cutoff, right? Like, I mean, I personally, to me, that'd be like if you criticize a 21 year old for drinking alcohol, it's like, ah, but they're almost 20, you know? It's just like, she's young. And I think people are less mature now because responsibilities aren't placed onto them until they get older. You know, we're seeing people stay home later, people like in their mid 20s, not working at all, living at home with their parents and stuff. Uh, you know, I, we see that more and more. And like, I feel like people are growing up slower because of that. But at the end of the day, it's a life experience. Like, she's old enough to know what's going on, even if she doesn't make the perfect choice, but that's like life, right? And it's not going to be a horrible, tra traumatizing choice. It might be like a cringe choice, or maybe she's happy. Maybe they're both going to be in love and happy. Maybe they're both in love. Yeah. I don't know. Go off. You know, do your thing, man. Imagine letting Boogie blow your back out. That's what I was smirking about. I read that comment. That's funny. Hey, listen, maybe he's maybe hey, maybe he's giving it her the little boogie. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, listen, God bless him. I don't particular. I don't know. How I feel about him as a person. I think he's just too much of a fucking crybaby. But you know, whatever. And uh, that's it. Have fun. Yeah. I just don't want to see it. I don't care. You don't want to see the OnlyFans? Well, I was gonna ask you, does she have an OnlyFans? Like, do you think she does? I I don't think so. I didn't even think about that. Uh, maybe. Do you want me to like investigate or? No. Well, you said that you already watched stuff about this. Yeah, I never noticed an OnlyFans. I feel like that's not something he would be able to emotionally deal with. Not that I would either, but uh, he seems he seems like very. I'm just asking because we. I was clean. trying to like um, get a judgment of her character. So OnlyFans plays into my judgment of character. I kind of get what the you're only saying. Thing I was asking. Okay, I get what you're saying. Um, the frontal lobe does not fully develop until 25. I don't know, man. It still seems like he's taking advantage. That that's what I'm talking about. Though. Like taking advantage is like such a, it's such an intentional word. You know, you're you're assigning so much intent onto this guy. If you think that she's like young and she hasn't fully developed frontal lobe, and so like maybe she's, you know, maybe her decision isn't that great because of that. That's fine. But to say like he's taking advantage, I don't think that Boogie can take advantage. <laughs> 
Uh, you just think he's that fucking... Why? Why? He just, just seems to, like... Boogie... What is his name? Uh, William. William? No, I made that up. Oh. I think it's Steven. Well, I just think that he needs a lot of care. Yeah, he does. You know? I think, yeah, yeah, I think it's his, his ex that he I think with. that he could be um, taken advantage of. That's, I mean, yeah. that's, I mean, there's something there, you know, in the same way but, where you're like, oh, she hasn't developed. Maybe he's taking advantage of her. I mean, how, who's to say that she's not taking advantage of him? This 50 year old lonely guy that has a lot of medical problems and, you know, just wants somebody to, 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 to love him. You know, I mean, I, um, she's a small, skinny white girl with blonde hair. She has pretty privilege. Uh, uh, pretty privilege. Check pretty privilege. Do you think that she does though? She has like Alabama. Pretty, she has like a Alabama pretty privilege. She is a nice looking She's girl. She's a nice looking girl. I've, I I got to check myself. I'm sorry. It's not she's a, she's a nice looking girl though. I hope that they're happy together and I hope neither of them are taking advantage of the other one. Okay. And I doubt that they are or maybe they are. It's higher. I think there's a higher chance of her taking advantage Look, of him. Listen, if you you saw the you went through their videos a little bit, he took her to the beach to the beach at one point. Oh What's so point? who's winning here? I guess not you. Because <laughs> I'm not taking either fucking beach. Uh, so. All right. Well, you know what? I think that's uh, I think that's it for this segment. God bless. <laughs> why, are you la why are you laughing? Because I love you. I love you. I love you. Here, give me a kiss.